What about this uh, stuff here? This doesn't look like it's at the same level of abstraction, right? We have this low-level stuff with a new size. Inline. Inline. Inline what? Inline size plus, oh, so inline new size? Uh, yeah. Okay. I'll inline it. Now what? Remove the curly braces. Remove <laughs> <laughs> I'll take it. <laughs> now what? Anything else? I want to back up one minute. I want to back up one second here. I just want to show you something. Let's just back up. We're on the test. And what if I were to just extract this in here into something that was a little more readable, right? I'll refactor it to uh, should grow, right? And then it's a little more readable, right? It says, if should grow, new size, resize. Is that good? Is that better? Hmm. It, does it read like English now? Do you ever say things like, if should grow, new size? <laughs> Can you do that? I don't. <laughs> uh, in fact, it's not good. Let's undo it. It wasn't a good uh, refactoring. And as we did before, um, we do want to inline this first. Then, after inlining it, by the way, I'm not going to run the test after inlining because I, I trust it. I know it's working. I don't even need to run the test for that. Um, I'll run this here and now I'll say should grow. Now that is starting to look a little more like English. If read only return, if should grow, resize. We'll get rid of the unnecessary curlies. We are professionals and we have tests. Uh, that's good, right? <coughs> Anything else to make this readable? So maybe convert this into uh, add new element. Thank you. Add new element. Call it that. A lot more better. Okay, so we just made uh, three private methods. Oh no. Is the performance going to be a problem now? Does anyone think that's going to be a problem? Show of hands. Performance issues with this? The compiler is going to handle that, right? Yeah. We, can, we can actually show that with a profiler. But this has absolutely no impact on the performance. So don't use that as an excuse for not extracting methods. This is our job. This is probably one of the most important jobs we have in refactoring, is to make the code readable. Ken Beck calls this a composed method. It's a method composed of other calls to other methods. And it's readable, and it's at the same level of abstraction. There aren't any low-level details mixed in with high-level details. Everything's about the same level of detail. Now, is the design awesome yet? Not quite. 